Well, hello, welcome to Izzy's Tarot. Thank you for coming to my channel. You could have gone anywhere, but you came to my channel for that. I'm always grateful. Thank you so much. I'm going to do an Aries love prediction reading for July 22nd through July 28th. Please keep in mind, this is a general read. If it's not your story, it's not your story. Don't try to make it your story. Just take what you can from it. Leave the rest. In addition, please know this energy can go either way. It can be your energy. Your significant other's energy or someone else that's in your love space. Please keep that in mind as you watch and as you listen. If you enjoy my reading or if my reading resonates with you, please give me a subscription or a like. I'd be most humbled. I'm always honored and very grateful if you decide to give me a subscription or a like. Thank you in advance if you do. Let's see what's going on with my impulsive, fun, kind, sweet, loving, Aries, show me spirit guides. What's going on, my Aries? Show me. Let's see, spirit guides. Show me, Aries. What you got going on? Show me, spirit guides. See the star, seven of pentacles. Queen of Wands, it's you, Aries, showing up in your reading. Three of Cups. And the Judgment card. Wow, Aries. First of all, the Star card, which can represent an Aquarius sun sign, is leading your reading. And the star card is all about dreams coming true, hopes, wishes, desires. Uh, it's just about a dream that's coming true. And I'm going to be very, very honest with you. Um, this is definitely one of those reads where I see that a dream is coming true. I see the seven of pentacles that's here next to the star card here, which is the seven of pentacles. It means that you put in the work. You put in the work for what you want. And you know what? I'm going to tell you what I think you want is a ring. I'm just being honest. You're ready. I think you're ready to be married. What you want is a ring and a date. What you want is a ring. What you want is marriage. You're ready. You put in the work and you're like, what is taking, what is happening? And I do believe that you are going to get a ring. I'm going to be very honest with you because here's a queen of wands that's in the middle of the reading. Queen of wands is you, Aries. Queen of wands is a um, fire sign. Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries. Queen of wands is someone, she's all about her... Um, uh, Queen of Wands gets what she wants. Queen of Wands, when she says she wants it, she wants it, and she wants it now. Queen of Wands is not, is, is um, she commands things. Um, she knows what she wants. People want to be with the Queen of Wands woman. Um, and when I say people want to be with her because she has this certain um, je ne sais quoi about her. And that's a, that's a crazy term, but she's got a certain something mm, about her. There's something about her, and you know that you got it. You know that you've got it, but what you need is the ring because you're ready for the marriage. I'm ready, but here, I'm going to tell you what I think. You're about to get the ring because here's this three of cups here. Here's this three of cups. I don't know what holiday you're going to get it on that's coming up, but when I see the three of cups, that's all about having a celebration, a good time, a wedding. It's going to be a wedding soon. Um, somebody's, I think, is getting ready to propose to you. Um, and not only that, that judgment card is, is the last card that is after this three of cups. And the judgment card is all about uh, one of those uh, moments where it's like, oh, I mean, it's like it's, it's really happening. That's what I look at. It's really this is really happening, Aries. Get ready. This is really, really happening. Because the judgment card is about an awakening, under knowing, going, whoa, coming out of a state of just. Being a, a, a dreaming, you're past this, even though the star card is, is your dreams coming true. You're past dreaming. This is all when I see the judgment card that's there. That judgment card is all about a realization saying, oh, this is really happening. Oh, yes, it's really happening. Get ready. Get your nails done. Whatever you do, get ready. Because there's a, there's a proposal and there's a wedding that's coming. I don't know when the proposal is coming. But when I see this, I, I'm looking at, I don't know when the next holiday is. Uh, Thanksgiving, Christmas, I don't know, but it's coming. It's coming. Absolutely. Could, I, I, it's on its way. So give me three to five minutes. Let me clarify the reading. I'm going to clarify the reading. 
let's see what the spirit guys additional information the spirit guys want you to know sit back relax aries and let me just clarify the reading let's see what additional information the spirit guys want you to know why is the star card here show me spirit guys why is the star card here for my aries knight of wands yeah he's a knight of wands yeah he's been a non-committal person oh but he's about to commit he's been he's you have a lot of passion with him when it's on you guys have got it going on all you want is a commitment and i told you it's a proposal that's on its way your dreams are coming true you your dreams are coming true absolutely he's tired of being out there he knows he loves you he's getting ready to propose so let's see why the seven of, of pentacles is here show me spirit guys you put in the work though you put in the work you knew what you wanted. You know that you want. You knew you wanted marriage. You put in the work. So let's see why the Seven of Pentacles is here. Show me spirit, guys. Why is the Seven of Pentacles here? Look at that. Told you. Six of Wands. You're winning. You have won. Just get ready. Just get ready because the proposal's on its way. That Six of Wands is all about winning. Winning. You put in the work. The Seven of Pentacles. When I say put in the work, that means you've been there. You stuck by his side. Even when he went through some of his shenanigans, you still stayed. You 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 know what I'm saying? You showed your loyaltyness. You showed your faithfulness. Absolutely. Six of Wands is winning. You're winning. It's your turn, Aries. It's your turn. Get ready for your proposal. So let's see why the Queen of Wands is here. Show me spirit, guys. Why is the Queen of Wands here? It's all about you, Aries. It, I, and I'll say that again. And you love to be in that in that space. So don't don't send me any nasty. Yes, Aries loves to be in that all about you space. And that's where it is. Aries likes attention. This attention is all about you. Get ready. So let's see why the Queen of Wands is here. Show me spirit, guys. The magician. The magician is that magic dust, girl. That magic dust. Magician is all about manifestation. You've manifested this. Didn't I tell you the Queen of Wands? She gets what she wants. She knows what she wants. She goes after what she wants, and she gets what she wants. That's why this magician card is here. That magic. You, you, and you got the magic too. You've got the magic touch. You're gonna be married. Get ready. Get ready for the proposal. So let's see. Show me. Why is the Three of Cups here? Show me, Spirit guys. Why is the Three of Cups here? For my Aries. Let's see. Why is the Three of Cups here for Aries? Queen of Pentacles. Look at that. Look at that Queen of Pentacles. You got the paper. You ready? The Queen of Pentacles is the is the mother. Um, she she's got the bag. Hey, Aries, just and it's over this uh three of cups. Because he knows what he has with you. You got the fire, you got the money. You know how to handle things. You'll be a good mother. You know how to make paper. You'll take care of the home. You know how to do both. You know how to be in the boardroom. You know how to be in the CEO. You know how to, if you got businesses, you know how to take care of them. But you also know how to be a mother. You're nurturing. You're kind. You're sweet. Look, just get ready. That's why that Three of Cups is there. He knows. He knows. Let's see. Show me why this judgment card is here. Show me, spirit guys. Why is the judgment card here? Show me spirit guides. Whew, not of swords. Oh, this man not playing. Get ready. Aries, like I said, get your nails done. Get ready for the proposal. You're going to be married. You're going to be married soon. The knight of swords is all about being courageous and brave. That judgment card, like I said, is, oh, he's coming at you. You're saying, is, this is really happening. Yeah, what you manifested is happening. It's absolutely, it is happening, so get ready. Let's start at the very beginning, the star card. Your dreams and wishes, your goals, your desires are coming true. The star card is dreams coming true. He's a knight of wands. And when I say he's a knight of wands, he's, and I'm going to say he's just been, he's, uh, it's been on and off possibly. Um, he has other women, He or he has had other women. He's been noncommittal, but you know what you want. And here you are, the seven of pentacles. Seven of pentacles means you put in the work. You put in the work, and guess what? The squeeze is worth the juice that you're going to get out. You put in the work because the Six of Wands is there, and that means you're winning. You have won. You have won. You're the Queen of Wands. Look at the Queen of Wands in the in the middle of the reading. This is you. Queen of Wands has a genesis quad. She knows what she wants. She, she's going after what she wants. She is undeniable, undeniable. You will not deny her. You manifested this with that Magician card. That's a powerful card. 
The power of manifestation, that's a powerful card. That magician card, you manifested what you wanted, and guess what? <laughs> it's here. Get ready. The proposal is on its way because here's the Three of Cups. There's going to be a wedding here. There's going to be a wedding. Get ready. Three of Cups is celebration. Get ready. Queen of Pentacles, you have the energy for the Queen of Pentacles. You're nurturing, you're kind, you got a bag, you're commanding. You have every, all everything that this man wants. He knows it. That's why now he's not about to lose you, and he's about to commit. He's about to commit. I do see the judgment card here, and that judgment card is like a realization, but I see it's a realization. It's, it's a realization for you. It's a, because you're saying, oh, this is actually happening. Yes, it's happening. Yes, it's happening. You like the attention. I'll say it again, Aries. You do. And so you know the attention is come, becoming, it's going to be on you. Knight of Swords says he's being courageous and brave. He's being courageous and brave. Absolutely. He's coming. He's coming. That's all I got to say. Just get ready. Get your nails done. I don't know what holiday, what's coming, or somebody's birthday possibly. I don't know. But get ready. Because he wants you, he wants to be married to you, you've manifested this, and it's about to, it is happening. So let's see, let's see, what do my oracles have to say? Sit back, relax, um, let me see what my oracles have to say about this relationship. Show me spirit, guys, what do my oracles have to say? Oh, straight card, out the box, this is what my oracles are saying, success, your manifestation is working, you manifested it, it's working. You put up with all his, his shenanigans and everything. It's working. Absolutely. Let's see what else my spirit. Ooh. <laughs> yes. 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 You know, my spirit, guys, I don't know. What do we have coming up? It's saying within the next few weeks, it could be a birthday. I don't know, but there's something. You're about to be engaged. You are about to be engaged. Oh, I'm going to pull this a year from now. And a year from now, you're going to be married. I did. I'm, I'll say it. You're going to be married. You manifested this. You're going to be married. Uh, I'm going to pull this card as well because it's my favorite card. Meditation brings answers, which is if you pray, whatever, pray. Uh, whatever, if you meditate, meditate, which I think you've already done because you've manifested this man. And what you wanted him to do. Uh, it says be assertive. I'm going to pull this card. I don't know an Aries that is not assertive. So, hey, I have to pull it for you, Aries. I got to pull it for you. Let's see what my what my last cards are here. Um, let's see. Let's see what my last cards are here. Well, well I'll pull these because they're coming back to back, which I think is important. Big happy changes. Yes, you're going from being single to being married. You're getting, you're manifesting your dreams. Yes. Yes, Aries, yes. It is happening. That's what I have for you for your love prediction reading, Aries.